guys, what's up? It's Nicole and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I have a special haul for you guys. Today, I went to K-Pop in USA, which is in Orlando, and I went with my friend Kim, and um, we just spent the day together. I literally just got home. Like, I parked my car, and I got home, and I ran in here, set everything up, and wanted to film for you guys. Now, I dyed my hair. How you doing? If this is the first time that you are seeing my face, I used to be blonde. Um, recently just dyed my hair brown on Monday, so this is the final look. If you haven't seen the vlog of when I vlogged my day of when I dyed my hair, I will link it up in the YouTube card, so go ahead and watch that video. So let's just get into this K-pop in USA haul. Now, I will be telling you guys how much everything was. So, because I have everything in front of me right here. Alright, so the first thing that I picked up was a K-pop transparent car 25 um, picks. It's the BTS one right here. And it has um, 25 cards in here. And this was $12.99. So, yeah. I had so many choices. I'm not going to take um, the cards out, but I'm going to look at the cards later. But there's that. And then I also got BTS Dark and Wild. Ah! You guys know that I have been dying to get this album for so long. I love Dark and Wild so much. I will do an unboxing and open it, but I'm not going to unbox it right now. I will open it privately off camera. But I got Dark and Wild, and this album was $22.99. Probably the most expensive album. I was going to get um, either this one or School of Affair, but like, I'm, I'm really, I'm getting all the BTS albums piece by piece. So I got Dark and Wild, which I'm really happy with because I love this album so much. I have been listening to it a lot lately, so heck yeah. And then the next thing that I got is a keychain with Jimin on it. Um, Park Jimin right there. My camera will focus. But yeah, I got a um, Jimin keychain. And this Jimin keychain was $6.99. And then, boys and girls, the last and final thing that I got at K-Pop in USA was a hoodie. And it was $24.99. It is a medium. It says BTS um, on the front here, and then on the back it says Jimin95 because if you guys know, Jimin is my bias. So just to recap on what we got, we got Dark and Wild, their album, which came out in 2014. Oh my god. And then we got a Park Jimin um, K-Ring, so a K-Ring for my keys. This was $6.99. And then we got a BTS transparent card. There's 25 cards in here and they're all the members of BTS. So I got this. This was $12.99. And then the last and final thing that I got was this BTS hoodie that I just showed you. It's black and it says BTS on the front and then Jimin95 on the back right here. As you all know, like I said, Jimin is my bias. So that is everything that I picked up at K-Pop in USA. Um, I'm really happy that I went over there. I've always wanted to shop over there because I've heard that they have some cool things. So thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. I know it was kind of short and you know everything, but I just really wanted to go to K-Pop in USA and I had such an amazing time with my friend Kim. After we left K-Pop in USA, we went to McDonald's and I ate some food. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, if you like hauls, go ahead and give it a thumbs up for me and let me know what kind of videos you want to see in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to be yourself because everyone else is taken. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye guys.